I'm going to give you the same answer I gave you a month ago. <laughs> so if you want me to do that, we'll go ahead and do that. We're exploring all opportunities in taxes. You know, we, we want to protect American jobs. We really do. As, I, as we started out, we're talking about jobs today. It's Jobs Friday. We want to bring jobs back to America. We want to bring manufacturing jobs back to America. So anything we can do to incentivize manufacturers to come back to America, that's important to us. That said, taxes is just one of the tools we have at our disposal. Right now, I think you all know we're actively involved in health care and health care reform. When we get done with health care reform, we are going to get to taxes. We are actively working on a variety of different tax alternatives, and we will present a tax plan when we're done with health care. So we're going to get an answer from you guys at some point, I would assume, in terms of the specifics on that border adjustment tax and or what you're going to do to replace it, if you don't like it, to keep the rate low but not bust the deficit? Or do you not care? Absolutely. I mean, is that one, is that a view of the administration, though, Gary, that maybe, you know what, forget about the deficit, let's just get tax reform through regardless of the revenue raisers that may need to be a part of it? No, no, we do care. We do care. We care about the deficit. We care about revenue. We care about what's going on. We're going to most likely, we're going to absolutely do taxes under reconciliation. We're going to have to be deficit neutral over a 10-year period. Yes, we will be able to use dynamic scoring. And we think we've got some opportunities to do that and, and, and do it in a very constructive way for U.S. consumers, for U.S. industry, for everyone as a whole. We are working on a bunch of really interesting ideas to reform the tax system in the United States. Gary, uh, put your gold, your old Goldman Sachs on. Uh, this and this stock market feels uh, a booming. Jim, so Jim well. I'm not. Jim, <laughs> Jim, I'm not allowed to do that. Right, forget Goldman. Forget Goldman. <laughs> Whatever. That was a great place to work for a couple of weeks. Um, so this this trillion, this stock market boom, two trillion dollars in wealth. How important is the stock market to this White House? Look, the stock market is important to us, but it's just one of the barometers that we're looking at. Uh, we look at the stock market every day, but we look at the employment data. We're looking at GDP data. We're looking and talking to CEOs every day about what they're seeing in their business, about what their hiring needs are, what their opportunities are, where they see opportunities for us in America. So, look, the stock market is, an, is a barometer. The nice thing about the stock market, it's a fairly real-time barometer for us, so we do look at it. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.